Hey guys, this is Shaquana coming at you with another video. This time you will be watching me install my yarn twist. I am, yeah, this is my go-to style for the fall, fall or the cold months because my hair tends to dry out more. So I like to keep it in a protective style uh, majority of the cold months so here I am showing you all the products and all the supplies that I use while installing my twist um I will try and have all of the products uh in the description box I'm not sure as to where I got each and everything but I will put them in the description box so that you will know what I used um yeah so this is one of my go-to, as I said, protective styles. Right there, I'm showing you where I had already prepped my yarn. I do believe I have the footage that's coming later on in this video. And just as well as me prepping the yarn beforehand, I you see my hair is in twist, And I didn't mean to have them in such small twists, so I paid for it because it took me a lot longer. But anyway, I did that the night before and make, made sure that I moisturized my hair a lot, a lot, lot. I um, put a lot on my hair before I started filming, so that's why you don't see me putting it on there. But I did show you the number of yarn strands that I used on each of the twists, which is, I started off with four, but as I get to my edges, I go down to three um, because ain't nobody got time for uh, the yarn claiming my edges. I want them. Um, what you saw me spray was water combined with olive oil. The reason why I do this um, is because I want to make sure that my hair and the yarn is moist because dry yarn makes my hair drier. So hence me pre-moistening the yarn uh, because it makes it a lot easier i have slowed the video down at this point to try and give y'all a view of how i roll um the yarn my twist in with the yarn to disguise it i don't know how good of a view y'all got but maybe you can pause it or see it but anyway I have not yet mastered the zoom in part, but I am working and practicing each time I put a video on. But yeah, guys, that's pretty much what I'm doing pretty much this whole video. Excuse the facial expressions. I had a lot on my mind during this time. Uh, I was looking rough, but um, anyway, the job got done. So um, yeah, I wanted to tell you guys uh, something about when I do install these long-term hairstyles uh, yes the yarn is drying and it could can be if you don't take care of it you have to moisten or condition your hair while it's put up um, normally I can keep these in for maybe a month to two months I try not to go past two months because it will start locking oh what you see me doing right now is making a knot at the bottom of the yarn uh, I do that I think at least three times so I slowed it down so that you can see how I um, make the knot in the yarn but um, yeah getting back to the care of these yarn twists uh, to me it doesn't take a lot but to somebody who's you know not used to keeping their hair up that long it may seem like a lot but guys I love this hairstyle again I am trying or, or growing out some heat damage in my hair um, it's another way that I get a chance to not have to have my hair out and while it's growing out from all the heat damage I didn't get that much I'll try to link that video in the description box and also the video of me twisting my natural hair um, I will link those up in the cards um, 
so look out for that so what you're seeing now th this is maybe two and a half hours to three hours worth of work because I stopped and started and stopped and started if you could tell the light changed I have two more left um, I think this time they turned out pretty good but back to why I am putting my hair into this protective style is because I do have heat damage like I said if you hadn't watched that video go watch it um, and because I don't like cutting my hair uh, right off the bat I like to let it grow out a little bit more and then I'll cut it um, I'll cut some inches off of it later there I'm showing you that I moved to three strands of the yarn um, yeah I ended up doing with my edges I do one less strand because as I said the edges are the most fragile part of your hair and when I take this style out I want my edges so <laughs> that's why I put three strands of yarn in and I'm trying to get up a little close so that you guys can kind of see how I was doing uh, how I installed the yarn but yeah I don't know how good of a view that is but yeah I just slowed it down a minute so now I'm I sped it up and I wanted to leave this part in to show you guys that no the installation is not always smooth sometimes I have to take them in and out to get them where I want them to be but hey that's that's how it is sometimes so yeah I guess it took me about three times to get this one in I was getting really aggravated because I was toward the end um don't know what I was doing with the camera there but anyway anywho back to um the reason I go to this style in the winter months um it is a style that I can depend on but guys just because my hair is in this style I by no means neglect my hair I have to continue to take care of my hair um, what you see me do was put some edge control uh, at the end of my twist so that it can blend in with the um, yarn so yeah but anyway if you want a more detailed video or step-by-step -step video of how I do this just shoot me a comment in the comment section you know that's fine and hey let me stop right here if you have not to subscribe to my to me guys listen I I am learning I am new to this thing so if you enjoy this video just hit the subscribe button and hit the notification bell so that you can be alerted as to when I got a new video out because um, if Lord the Lord's willing I am going to try to put out more videos at this point I have been doing a video each month I think something like that I think it's been a month since I put one out but you guys that are subscribed to me I want to thank you so much in advance but um, don't give up on me um, just bear with me I'm still learning and I need some more things equipments and more lessons and need to get my niece back over here so that she can show me some more tricks such as the zoom in and all of that high scarlet um but anyway yeah and not to mention scarlet uh go and check her out scar scar love i think i'll have her information down in the description box she is her videos are so cute she is a middle schooler um she tells about her little life and what's going on over in that age world but yeah go check her out I'll try to have her information in the description box so go check my niece out um, well back at the video at hand I did slow it down to try to show you guys how I attach it so I hope that this view gives you a better um, understanding of how I install them but anyway I think that is all I need to say about this right now so I'm going to stop at this moment and let y'all finish watching the rest and I'll catch back up with you toward the end
guys that's it i am now just playing around with my hair i think it turned out great again i just like to say um to those of you who have already subscribed thank you so very much and to those of you who just stopped by or just scrolled by and saw me uh feel free to subscribe it's free um so my videos consist of um my life as a person with cp and yeah come check me out so till next time thanks for watching